Hey y'all, uh, it's Troy. Uh, just doing a really quick and dirty video. No editing, no worrying about lights, no makeup, uh, no rehearsal. Just down and dirty lid presentation. So obviously I was a little bit upset with the price of the auxiliary purge lid from Extract Craft 225. It's just stupid. These lids are, you know, maybe between 50 and $100. Uh, so that price is just stupid. So I wanted to find an alternative, and what I found was an A-Blaze uh, set. It comes with this lid, which fits on perfectly on the Ito kettle, so it worked really well. But the question came up, uh, is that acrylic or is it glass? Because in one set, it's described as tempered glass, saying they'll never use acrylic anymore. And in another set, it says it's an acrylic lid. So... I had to check myself, I had to take the post down, I had to check myself, and I thought, you know, well, if I have to check, maybe other people don't know the difference or how to tell. So there's a few different ways how to tell. And just by looking at them, I've got a few lids here. You can't really uh, tell a whole lot just by looking at them, you know? They look very similar. These look the same. One's glass, one's polycarbonate. Excuse me, one's glass, one's acrylic. Again, these look pretty darn close too. One's, car one's uh, polycarbonate, one's glass. So, is this glass or is it acrylic? So this, these are a few different ways how you can tell. One way is you can just grab a hold of them and touch them. Glass feels kind of cool to the touch. Polycarbonate and acrylic are kind of warm. They feel just... Um, uh, neither way. They feel just like room temp. Glass to the hands feel a little cold to the touch. Another great way to tell is you can hit them. This one's acrylic. Here it just kind of thuds. Let me crank that down so it doesn't chink. Here it just thuds. Glass on the other hand chings. You hear the difference? This one goes thud, this one goes, this one thuds, this one chings. Hear that? So let's test the A-Blaze one. Does it thud or does it ching? Chings, right? As opposed to as opposed to thud. So I'm pretty confident Kind of cool to the touch. Chings more than it thuds. So I'm pretty confident it's glass. So it feels cool, chings. The other way, when you look at the grind on the side and you feel them, with the polycarbonate and acrylic, it feels kind of plasticky. You know, it doesn't feel real dense, it doesn't feel real hard, and it feels a little plasticky. When you touch glass, it actually feels a little more hard and it feels a little more scratchy. Whereas acrylic feels a little more smooth and polycarbonate. Polycarbonate actually has a fairly clear cut on the side. And again, when you feel it, it feels plasticky. What do we got here? On the A-Blaze, you know, smooth. And it feels pretty hard. So I'm feeling pretty confident that this is glass. We always second guess yourself. Ching ching. So I'm waiting to hear back from the manufacturer. Thunk thunk. Ching ching. And I know for a fact this one's glass. So it looks to be a pretty clear-cut case of it's definitely tempered glass, so I'm not sure why they have the different listings. I think maybe they just haven't um, updated them yet. Anyway, that's all it is. Glass versus acrylic and polycarbonate. Hope it means something to you. Hope you learned something. Stay lifted, my friends.